Hello everybody, my name is Sansa. Welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalis 4 is Austria. Last time, stuff happened, basically. Also, there's a colonial disaster. Lose 200 percent Oh no, not our Diplo points. How could we ever deal with that? Okay, we have too many Diplo points. I don't know what to spend this money on, or spend the points on. I don't like to spend them on, you know, buildings. Oh, we can get more trade power. Those are 74. Get a marketplace there. But we don't have enough money to really do anything. Let's just increase, I guess, the Caribbean. Like, we could do this, but it doesn't even really, really spend our points that well. Like, we only got rid of, like, 100 points, and I'll be done in 10 months. Because we get, like, 10 a month. Because our guy is, like, 6 Diplo. He's, like, really good, but our heir is awful, so hopefully someone can kill him off, you know, before any of this has to happen. Or before he comes to power. Which would be nice, in all honesty. How does Spain own this territory? Is this, is this province coastal? I guess so. These two might be coastal. So that's how they own that. France hasn't even started colonizing. Great Britain's colonized like the worst parts of Canada, so I don't know what they're even thinking. We're getting all this nice, juicy, you know, land. There's a lot of gold down here, which is probably going to suck for our inflation. But I really don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. Portugal's mainly staying in South America, like they generally do. I don't really know what, I'll, what I'm going to do with Africa. I don't know what I'm going to do with, you know, Asia at this point. Like, I'm probably going to, you know, take, once I take over... I'll just take that. Oh, I need those admin points, actually, really badly. Thanks for that. But anyway, once I completely take over Mexico, I should have a nice jumping off point to actually get into, you know, Southeast Asia, Indonesia, India, places like that. So hopefully, good things will come of that. Stability, I can boost stability, but once again, how, what's the... 78, so that's like next, two months from now, hopefully. Nearly, I'm not going to take that because I need those, I need that, that tech, like now. Wait, what's this for? Is this not, does it not cost 360? Oh wait, isn't there a, I think there was an upgrade or something that made that cheaper. I don't exactly remember. How many points until we need a, one more idea until we get plus two relations. That's really good, but I need this so I can get another idea group. I'm just gonna let the time go by. I'm actually just gonna read what the next idea three groups could even be. It's gotta be something in this tree. Probably exploration. Because I want to have a nice colonial empire, and that's going to be really useful. And I have all these points, and I can't do anything with them. If I if I get, like, chances are, I can probably get the next level of this before I can even spend these points effectively. And how old is my guy right now? He's only 41, so hopefully he has like another 40 years to live. But I don't think generally people don't seem to live very long, which sucks. Cherokee, 33%. No, 85%. Wow. 38, 50, 99? I'm kind of surprised by that. By the way, the Aztecs. Okay, we need plus 190, and then we can start the whole vassalization of them. So hopefully that should be a reality once this is done. So then we can get all the Aztecs. I don't know when the Mayans are actually able. 1601, actually, so never mind. This should all be done pretty soon. First the Aztecs, then probably the Mayan, and then the Zapotec last, because they're the smallest. Native Uprising, I think they're already dead, so it doesn't even matter. And then one more territory, or once this is colonized, this will give us, you know, a nice border right here. And basically, as long as they don't, I don't know how much of the world that Portugal and Spanish have discovered, but that should also give us a nice everything in California, basically. I mean, hopefully, if all goes according to plan, which apparently which I actually don't have. It's still going to take us, what, how many years? Just over two years in order to actually fully resupply our armies. And then, you know, I have to wait a few years after that. And then, you know, we can actually build a, a bigger army, which is something we really need. Venice, Spain, Poland... How's that Phoenician war going? It's not going that good. So, gain 100 population. Actually, that should basically mean it's colony 
He's almost done. Well, it should be done pretty soon. Ah, uh, let's go back to where we need to be. It would be nice if these guys... Do I have a core here? No. I don't. Where do I have a core? Do I have a core in any of these places? No, not at all. If they become independent, though, I'll definitely try to vassalize them. 100% more... 100% imperial authority. Hey, these people... Negative 10? Oh, they really don't want me to... On that list. against it 17-4 what's that gonna do like that only makes us worse why would we want this like I don't I, I should just leave like once it gets too bad I should just abandon all hope for that also look at all these nice lovely t look, look what's this nice territory I have now also I might be over the uh Cap. Oh, by two troops. And that sucks. These guys all... Cap, they all instantly upgrade. So, one, two. Select this unit. Disband. Then these guys... There's no cavalry, which sucks. And they can't move at all, because they have no, uh, morale. Come on, morale. There we go. That also gives us a very nice, I think, powerful... Who's the, it's Great Britain? Oh, wait, no, that's not Great Britain. That's the, uh, the Shawnee? No, not the Cherokee. Yeah, the Shawnee. Oh, there's an uprising. Oh, this territory right here. I can't get to that. That's an issue. I just can't get there. And this will be the, the fourth time that country's become independent? That's dumb. That's back to where we need to be. So as our... Aztec's maxed out. It takes a long time for our guys to get back. But it's time to start... Oh, wait, it's not even... We can't. Oh, because we annexed the vassal and they hate us for it. Hmm. That music played. That usually means something. Apparently it doesn't. Okay. 21 years ahead of the time. But we do have a new uh, Diplotech. Which is fine. Oh, look at that. We're like bright green and all that. We're way ahead of the time. We're ahead of the time on basically everything. Right? I mean, I, we might not be ahead of the time in terms of military. We're probably still a little. Not by eight years, actually. So that's pretty good. All these guys are Creek, though. And that, that's not an accepted culture. How much does it cost? 25... Oh, okay, so that's actually what Diplo points a, a sink into, which will be really good once, uh, you know, once we basically just start racking up all the points again. Cost 10 points, 10 points, done, done, then 20, and I don't have that. Hey, there's more nationalists rising up. Wonderful. Okay, go to troll. Or just go to troll. Whatever. You don't even need to go to troll. Why are these people so mad? Like, why are they so mad all the time? Like, you have no reason to be mad. Do we have a better leader? No. Maybe? What is this? Renewver shot. I hate this because we're crossing into a river... And it's going to, you know, give us huge troop losses. And that's just going to, you know, make our reinforcements take years again. So hopefully you're fine with that. Once again, another four years until we can even start building more troops. Colonies become self-sustaining. And then, once we colonize here, the name should be, like, spelt out. Kind of like that. I don't know how it's going to spell out the name. It might just go over this, this one territory. I'm not 100% too sure yet, though. 172. How long will that take? It's gonna take a little while, maybe. Overseas expansion against you? They're rich and weak. Oh, 
emotional superiority. They're allied. Oh, they don't give us into India. Indian territory is also always nice. There's a lot of the world we know about. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the empire. I have no reason to stay at this point. Oh, the Shawnee are actually here. I can see them now. So I'm probably gonna, you know, vassalize them as well. Like ten a month. That's insanity. Why can't I do this? 125. How come they're so much more expensive over there? But that was our old capital, I think. Spanish hate me. Rebels have crossed into the border. Well, that's fine. Those are my rebels in the first place. There's nothing I can do, but I want them gone. I don't think... Will they, will they take up? Probably. Yeah. Bavaria, I know you hate me. Oh, actually, they'll just give me military rights, actually. So, never mind. So, let's go to my troops here. You know, get this territory back into my hands and then walk out. And hopefully. Wow, oh, look at that. We got. It's time. I think it's time to go into India. I definitely think it's time to. Like, isn't. Look at that, look at these base tax values, oh, so good. I don't think, that, I don't think we can even vassalize them, so I don't know what the point of even asking for, for that would be. On oh, our Diplo and Avent ranks are going down, that sucks. Military, are, oh, we can actually get our military tech up again. I still want this up, they're not gonna let me do that. We now have a culture. Yonsies? I don't even know what that is. What culture became accepted? Creek. Why is it. Oh, because we're. Oh, wait, no. It's telling me that we converted them. Never mind. Never mind. I understand now. 50 points, that's gonna take two months. Where are our transports? There's four here. And four should definitely be able to take out like four plus our trade ships. Our trade ships should actually just kind of combine. Oh, the Timrids. Do we have any like main boats? Like I actually don't know what our fleet's even made out of. No, we have none. All we have are these trade ships. Which should protect trade in uh, the Caribbean. And hopefully now we should be able to beat those pirates. I'm not 100% too sure if that's going to happen or not, but... Like, who are these guys allied with? The Timurids, Delhi, and... Like, these guys, they just don't matter. That's the thing. Yeah, but how do I get... I can fleet basing rights, why not? Because they're... If I improve relationship with them, I could probably get fleet basing rights. I don't, I don't know. Do I want to go into India? I probably do. I probably do. There's a reason the British did it, so... I'll lose prestige? Okay. Anyway, one, two, three, four. You four thousand. You're gonna get on these ships. Hungry to clear one Bohemia, apparently. Okay, actually, before we do that, how about we get some fifty? Are they cheaper in our homeland? No, they build slightly faster. They build a lot faster. So, uh, yeah, they, two, so much faster, so, I can build four in a 
insane amount of time. But is that really faster? Kind of. Yeah, it is. So I'm just gonna get you guys attached to the transport. The transport should take a, you know, take a sneak away. You will just go straight into Austria. I don't know if that path is super dangerous. Oh, now it is, because still lost to pirates. Okay, then that should be a safer path, hopefully. And then, well, I guess we can just might as well make these guys into one bigger army. Oh, look. War. Wonderful. Regency. Let's see, pretender rebels. View your country. Ah. Uh, our regency council is terrible? Why do we have too many diplomatic relations? Military access. Oh, Bavaria. I can get rid of that. Give me a second, Denmark. I'll get with you in a second. For, get the troops out of De uh, Bavaria first, actually. That's a decent plan. Hungary. Hungary's out of the France. Well, Dania. I'll give it a few days. See who joined in. Denmark. Trainer. Vandenberg. Hungary and Tuscany. I'm assuming only Tuscany joined then. And then Denmark's fighting a completely separate war against France? Yes. Mostly because that's pretty one-sided. I don't know. Let me just look at the numbers here. It is pretty one-sided. I'm just going to go here. Bavaria. Uh, cancel with that. Oh, kill these! And kill the pretender rebels, like right now. Let me just check around. Is anything bad going on in the country? Where are our transports? I don't. Do they even have a fleet? They do. Tusk. Well, I guess Tusk only has a fleet, so I'm just gonna go. Actually, we're going to go into South America because there's no way they're probably gonna send troops all the way over here. Our stability is down. I should probably improve that. How long until we get? Uh, this? 408. Portugal, no. <sighs> Boost ability again. Oh, the Inca are here too. I forgot about them. Savages have damaged our colony. Uh, yeah, we should actually send our army over there into the colony that's. It's this one, right? Yeah. There's like no one there. There's 25 people there. I don't know how many people they killed, but it must have been a lot. Okay. Dynastic Annex. Oh, we're in war! Great. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. The Maya and the uh, Zabatek still hate me, I'm pretty sure. But that's fine. Well, they, they don't hate me. They're, they're positive. This is terrible. Why? Minus five to five. Is that? I actually don't know what that really means. But we're still plus three, even with that huge debuff kind of thing there. Which like a diplomatic tab. Yeah, it's just mostly against Hungary. And they're still allied with France. Who started this war? Hungarian conquest. Okay. Ulm's in it apparently, and so is Burgundy. Do I have any of the claims on these? No. Actually, I do. On Linka. So, actually... I might send troops there? No, there's no way Hungary... Uh, there's no way Denmark's actually going to give me the lance. Never mind. Never mind at all. Unless I get a separate piece? I doubt that's going to happen. Like, how broken can we make Hungary? You know, pretty broken, actually, so... I wonder if that's going to happen. Changing all the cultures, which is nice. How far ahead of the times are we now? Because I'm pretty sure... Well, 19 years. One... Two... I don't know how much these ones. 25. 50, and this one's what? 125? Yeah. So we're slowly... 
but surely getting these people to be pure Austrians. It's gonna take a little bit of time. Like, no one's doubting that. Wait, what? They just completely... What? How do they just completely decimate my army? What? Like, what's their... They're level 15. I'm level 17, and they have weaker units because they're... Eastern. They are Eastern, right? Yeah, those are definitely Eastern models. They're just worse. Why? Don't go there! Why would you go there? How long is it going to take to reinforce the armies now? Answer, forever, basically. How did that happen? That's what I don't get. Ports are being blockaded. That sucks. I shouldn't have joined this war, but I kind of had to. I'm not just going to walk on my troops again. Can you just... Where are they going? Osberg. Yeah, just join where I am. You, you should just be better soldiers. Like... Yeah, okay, they lost. Which is good. I still don't get how I... They had a lot more men, and I was defending. And my troops are better. And they're more advanced. I don't see why I should have lost that battle. Not at all. I wish I could actually just hide my armies right now, but I just can't. Like, I don't want them to be where they are. These guys are, yeah, they, they're still in South America. I know these four guys could just easily beat all of them. Oh, we have reason to kill Oh, we could probably get this island? Spain, Spain has a claim. Oh, Spain's got that thing where you just get claims on all of... All of India. It'd be nice if I want I want that. If you can just give me that. It's a defensive war. Hansa, Ripen, Flanders, Holland. Why are they... Hansa. Is Great Britain going to join it? No, it doesn't seem like it, so I'm going to join it. Yeah, they're going to like us more for it. Once again, I'm not going to actually help out at all. And once again... Show superiority. All enjoyed. Who's Britain allied with? Does have any Portugal, Spain, Hansa? Hansa's actually making a lot of gains. Which is surprising. Nobody wants me to be emperor. Not at all. Not a single person. Wants me is even close. We discovered an agent. Bohemia. What a jerk. Naval decay. No, I need this. 438. That's still a little while away. And it feels so slow now having like five. That's half of what I was getting before. I'm then I'm going to have to do all this. Doing all this work in the Aztecs again. Or later. Hopefully it's not going to be too big of an issue, though. If you just leave me alone, I'm just going to hide out back here and not worry about any of this. Have fun. But I just want the mission to have a foothold in India. And I'm probably going to take this island. Mostly because it it's, it's small, so it won't give me a lot of uh, aggressive expansion and overextension. Local defensiveness. Yes. Overseas expansion on Bru oh, Brunei. That's Indonesia. And that's exactly where I want to be. Lose 50 ducats, lose one prestige. I can lose 50 ducats. Like, let's be honest. Oh, but look at that. Base, base tax, 8. That's a lot. It's a pretty good base tax, if you ask me. 
And then the Hanzo are just going to instantly lose this war because they're bad at it. Everyone's fighting my country. Native Uprising, and they're already dead. So it's not really that big of a deal. And at the end of the year, I'm going to definitely end the episode. So I might as well just be doing the whole thing now. So thanks everybody for watching. My name is Vinance. If you have enjoyed, remember to thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy, thumbs down. Subscribe if you want to see more of the series. And all that good stuff. So I'll see you next time. Goodbye.